You know, the mission of the Fresno Chaffee Zoo is to inspire people to care for animals, to make connections, to build community, and to save wildlife. There is no better ambassador for that story than African elephants. If one animal can tell a story that saves hundreds of animals, that saves vast range habitat, then that animal is doing something incredibly meaningful, incredibly valuable. And if we can give that animal an incredibly good quality of life while it's doing that, I think that's a win-win for everybody. The thinking is that if you see an elephant in captivity, somehow you appreciate elephants and you want to do something to help elephants. Well, when captivity started in the United States uh, about 220 years ago, uh, there were 27 million African elephants. So if that model worked, if you go somewhere and see an elephant and you appreciate it and you want to save it, uh, it's not working because now there's about half a million. Good girl. Good girl, Tika. Let go. Hurry up. This is the only place, the only elephant place you'll ever come uh, in the world where someone will tell you that these elephants don't have enough space. They don't have the right social structure. You know, there's no right way of doing it. If we want to have these animals for exhibit into the future in zoos and aquariums around the country, we have to be very thoughtful and proactive in our breeding programs to have those sustainable, genetically diverse populations. And that's what we do. New breeding stock, uh, babies that are born in captivity, right, right now it's unsustainable. Hopefully in about 20 years, we'll look back at captivity like it was barbaric. And I think we're moving toward that.